As students return from spring break and go into end of year testing, we're taking a look into test anxiety. ABC 17's Jasmine Halliburton joins us live from the University of Missouri after talking with students. Jasmine, how common is test anxiety? Hannah, there are several students across the country of all grade levels that has experienced test anxiety, and it can even happen to people who just have to take any sort of test. Dr. Arpit Agarwal from MU Health says that moderate levels of anxiety helps your body and your brain to prepare for a test. However, that can change if you start feeling too much anxiety. When this level of anxiety getting starts getting more severe, and then it starts negatively affecting your performance. The students that I spoke to today told me they definitely experienced test anxiety and what they were feeling. I definitely have. I'd say more leading up to the test, I get super stressed and try to like memorize actually everything. But then like after the test, I usually feel more relieved. I feel like it makes me paralyzed and I don't know what to study or where to start for anything. So it's just stressful in its own way. Some physical symptoms can be fast heart rate, sweating, or sweaty palms, and maybe feeling like you're going to pass out. Some emotional symptoms can include feeling scared or an overwhelming sense of failure. Dr. Agarwal says cognitive symptoms can be all or nothing type of thinking. What, what if I don't do good on this test? What is my future going to look like? So it's called like all or nothing thinking. So if you think of uh, symptoms as physical, emotional, and cognitive, that really helps uh, students and teachers uh, keeping a track of these symptoms. It's really important to understand yourself. And if you have anxiety, that is 100% OK. Anxiety is not something that we should be ashamed of. And it's just something that happens in life. Dr. Agarwal says a common practice to help students going through test anxiety is to give them some more time. Reporting live from Columbia, Jasmine Halliburton, ABC 17 News. Thank you, Jasmine. According to a study done in 2023, over 79 percent of students experience high to extreme test anxiety.